Are you tired of getting smoked by your opponent's fast smashes and doubles? Well, don't worry. Today, I'm going to teach you five double smash defense drills that will help you to improve your defense. And make sure to comment, like, and subscribe. And let's start the video. So our first doubles defense drill will be just driving one straight and then driving one cross. And then this is an essential drill for doubles players because when people are smashing with fast smashes and doubles, you want to be able to drive back with fast drives as well because it creates counter-attack opportunities for you and your partner. And one tip I would have for this drill is to make sure that when you're, when you're defending, you want to make sure your racket movement is very short, like this. So our second drill for the double smash defense is to block one straight and block one cross. Sometimes this is an essential drill for doubles players because instead of driving all the time, sometimes it is better to block a smash and then move forward so that it creates a lift and um, counter attack opportunities for your partner at the back. And one tip I would have for this drill is to make sure that you put a lot of leg power into your legs and really get low in the defense position like this. So the third drill for the double smash defense is to do one lift and then one defense. Because in doubles, sometimes your opponents can mix up their smashes with drops, so it's definitely good to practice how to react to both drops and smashes. And then, and then one tip I would have for this drill is that when you, when you lift, you want to make sure to quickly get back into your defense position so you have more time to prepare for your defense shot. So our fourth drill for the doubles defense smash is continuous drives. Sometimes in a doubles rally, there can be a lot of drives going back and forth. So it would be very good to practice how to drive and swing fast and also increase your forearm strength like this. So one tip I would have for this drill when driving very fast continuously is to make sure to use your thumb on your grip when you're driving because that would help you to generate a lot more power like this. So our final drill for the double smash defense is to defend one drive first and then lift the second one. Sometimes in doubles, opponents will smash and move into the net as they would expect you to, to drive, drive back their smashes. But instead, sometimes what you can do is you can drive back the first smash and relift the second, second shot so that it will catch the opponent out of position as they move forward into the net. And then one tip I would ha really have for this drill is to make sure that when you're doing your drives and lifts, keep the motion consistent and the same. So it, the opponent wouldn't know that if you're hitting a drive or a lift for better deception purposes. If you want access to championship coaching and custom plan training plans and much more, please use my referral code down below to join our online badminton academy. So there you go. These are the five essential drills for you to improve your double smash defense. If you want to see more videos like this, please comment, like, and subscribe, and we'll see you next time.